On December 17, 2014, the NATO confirmed officially the involvement of their military forces along the Russian borders with the goal of the so-called peace and stability in the region. Yet earlier massive increase of activities of the NATO strategic and scouting air fleets were observed at the borders. It's not the first time that the North Atlantic Alliance had to appear as the guarantor of peace and stability in the world. Test Step NATO's first borderless efforts for peace and stability appeared at the time of the operation against the United of Republics of Yugoslavia from March 24 until June 10, 1998, accomplished without a mandate of the United Nations. NATO reached the so-called peace and stability by bombing civil objects in Yugoslavia, including the Republic's capital, Belgrade. The average number of killed civilians during the period of the NATO operation set at more than 1.7 thousand people, including 400 children. About 10,000 people were seriously injured. Because of the Alliance's airstrikes at the nitrogen plant and the oil chemical complex in Pancheva, emerged toxic air caused by the toxic streams of the hot oil combines. The oil of the exploded reservoirs poisoned the Donai and other rivers. The Skadarska lake and other lakes along with the Adriatic Sea were contaminated. The military forces of the Alliance used uranium-depleted ammunition against targets in Yugoslavia. After the statements of European unions and UN's officials, but as well of experts and right defenders, at the time of the combat secured radioactive contamination, resulting in loss of lives, onset of cancer and genetic disorders. Peace and stability in the region was established by the region's transition under the control of NATO and international administration. With peace and stability occurred ethnic cleansing against the Serb population in Kosovo and Metokia. 250,000 Serbs left the region because of fears for their security. Public opinion because of the actions of the NATO, in Europe regularly appear waves of protests against the Alliance's policy and actions. The protesters believe that the activities of NATO contribute the outbreak of military conflicts and named the bloc itself the symbol of global inequality. Such actions occur in countries where are members of the bloc, Germany, France and Greece, as well as in countries whose administrations seek the convergence to the bloc, Moldavia, Serbia, Ukraine and Georgia. Ukrainian crisis. At the end of the February 2014, in the southeastern Ukraine emerged under anti-government and federative slogans to protect the status of the Russian language massive social political actions against the Ukrainian nationalist organizations. The protests were provoked by the denial of the Ukrainian leadership what came to force because of the violent takeover of power. To consider the interests of the citizens of the country's southeast who are set to the preservation of the close relationships with Russia. Moreover, as well as the purpose of the ultra right movement and nationalist politicians who intensified their political influence during the Euromaidan to conduct the aggressive Ukrainization of the Russian speaking population. As Ansa, Kiev evolved the punitive operation against the citizens of the region. The civil war began, in the result of which the power of the Kyiv region was thrown back by formation of the people's self-defenses of Donbas. The Ukrainian president Petro Poroshenko was forced to agree a ceasefire. The people of Donbas defended their land and right of self-determination. Yet NATO steps up its military and political support of the Kyiv government. What comes next?